discuss Chef Marielle's grilled tuna steak. We asked Chef Marielle to share more of her personality with us, and I think she did. However, lack of marmalade and brandy tan just didn't deliver. What's that crazy, crazy boy doing? With the uh, doneness of the tuna, that's a big miss on her part. One of the things I think she nailed on the dish was the salad. She definitely uh, hit behind the You're crazy, right, Mochi? He's digging at something. Chef Luca's big eye tuna with rambutan salsa. I love the fact that he used the shell of the rambutan, which is so showy. Often the marmalade was lost. I mean, you could see the marmalade, but I want to taste it as well. The tuna itself was not crusted, and I was left with a pile of oil on the bottom of my plate. And finally, Chef Trevor with his seared big eye tuna. I thought that Chef Trevor's use of the rambutan was an afterthought. He just put it on top of the plate at the end. The use of the horseradish and the marmalade, it was a big, bright, beautiful condiment. It really did spark the tuna. And I can't believe I'm about to admit this, but I actually enjoyed the peanut butter and the potatoes. Judges, are you all agreed on a decision? some harsh uh, criticism that I didn't feel like hearing. I think there were more negatives in my dish than the rest of these guys. I don't want to go home.